What happens when a company with billions of dollars tries to make their own scratch? Does more money actually make it any better? Today, we're going to find out because Microsoft did that. I'm going to make a game in Microsoft Make Code Arcade against one of the biggest scratch YouTubers to see if billions of dollars actually made scratch better. Enjoy the video and consider subscribing if you like it. The plan for today is we are going to be making a game in Microsoft Make Code Arcade against one of the biggest Scratch YouTubers, Jackson Academy. So I think it's time to just jump into this and see if Microsoft Make Code Arcade is any better than Scratch. Yo, you know, hello. You're like a professional scratcher. I feel like I'm a little bit of a scratch noob, but also this isn't even scratch. Like. Who knows what Microsoft freaking make code looks like. Yeah, the blocks are so weird. It's, I, I did not get used to it. The way this is gonna work is we both have one hour to make a game in Microsoft make code arcade. And then I guess at the end, we will do a vote <laughs> on who created the best Microsoft make code game. I'm up for the challenge, let's do it. Okay, chat, give us some themes. Horror brain rot is a good theme. I don't know too much about that. Maybe the chat might know, but not me. Elden, we're not making Elden Ring. <laughs> we have one hour, guys. We have Halloween, Lunchly, Dark Souls. Okay. I keep saying brain rot, so I'll do brain rot. Why are people, a lot of people are saying Walmart. What is Walmart? It's like a store though. What is the Walmart? I mean, yeah, I, I like know what Walmart is, but why Walmart? All right, these are the top five themes that were suggested. Now it's time for you to vote on which theme we actually have to base our games around. All right, we have two votes for Lunchly, one vote for Brain Rot. Please don't make us make games about Lunchly. Walmart, oh, no. bro, what is Walmart? I don't understand. No, no way. <laughs> we have to make games about Lunchly. With that, it is time to get started. So right. I'm going I to set so. a timer <laughs> for one hour. And as soon as I press this button, the challenge will officially begin. Oh, Are you no. ready? I, I hope so. Three. Two, one, go, 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 go. Okay, good luck. I hope you win. Right. Just kidding, guys. I hope he loses. I don't. <laughs> so how about my game Lunchly versus Lunchables? So here's my idea for our Lunchly game. Let's say you have a box of Lunchly, and then let's say there are the falling pepperonis for the Lunchly pizza. You have the falling prime, and of course, falling Feastables. Okay, let's see if I can first upload the Lunchly sprites for a new asset, maybe? No, 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 that's not it, that's not it. Um, how do I upload? Gallery creates... Do I have to draw it? Are you kidding me? Okay, this might not look too good. I know they have these sprites already, but I want to upload the image because there's no way I'm drawing it. I don't have enough space to even write. How do I put it in? I think I might need a tutorial. I, I don't think I'll be able to do this by myself. So you have your Lunchly that you can move around and all of the Lunchly ingredients are falling from the sky and it's your job to build the Lunchly. But the problem is there's also falling mold. If the mold falls into your Lunchly, you get canceled and die. So you have to collect all the falling Lunchly ingredients and avoid the mold. And that is our Lunchly game. But now we have to figure out how to actually code this. I'm Daryl from Microsoft. Okay, let's find that block. Okay, wait, I see it on the screen. Okay, it's working, but where? I need to put my prime bottle. Where is it? Let me make the top of the prime bottle white. Are these seriously all of the colors I have? Are you kidding me? Do they not even have the color white inside of this scratch ripoff? Let me just make it black. This is not looking good already. I guess the first thing we should figure out how to do is put an image on the screen. So we need our Lunchly box. All right, we have, we, we, we have our Lunchly, we have our Lunchly. And now it's time to see how do you get a sprite on the screen in Microsoft Make Code Arcade. So let's make a new variable, let's call it Lunchly and pick our Lunchly from the gallery. Now, if I start the game, oh, we have a Lunchly, look at that. What is, why is it so tiny? It's like scratch, but they made it mini for some reason. Wait a second, guys. Is Lil Bro actually wearing wired headphones right now? Okay, something tells me he hasn't heard of the Raycon everyday earbuds. 
I don't know about this guy, but I love having my Raycon earbuds with me for runs, video editing, just about everything. The everyday earbuds have a 32 hour battery life so they can keep up with me all day. My favorite feature is multi-point connectivity, which lets you connect to multiple devices at once so I can switch from my phone to my computer super easily. I, I, I don't listen to this song or anything, by the way. I just, I pulled it up as like an, an example. <laughs> And even though Raycons are half the price of other premium earbuds, they still have all the must-have features like active noise cancellation to block out distractions and super comfortable gel tips that keep them snug and secure. If you want to check out Raycon, now is the best time. Their Black Friday sale is live and you can get up to 30% off site-wide. Just head over to buyraycon.com slash polymars and grab your pair today. Now. Thank you, Raycon. Now, it's time to destroy Jackson Academy. Okay, so we have Prime. Let me make another sprite. This time it's gonna be Lunchables. So Lunchables is gonna be the enemy. That does not look like Lunchables. Maybe if I just write it, lunch. Maybe if I just write lunch, whatever. I think the point gets across. Okay, now I need the enemy sprites. So I'm thinking it'll be the same. Okay, enemy sprites. What does that do? Oh, it spawns it on the screen. Okay. I think I got this. And we need to make our lunchly move with the arrow keys. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to say sprites, game, music, controller. So if I just say move lunchly with buttons, then that's just like, you can move it around with the arrow keys. But we only wanna be able to move left and right because the idea is we're just moving left and right to dodge falling lunchly ingredients. So now you take a close look at our lunchly, it's moving. I guess that's good. All right, we have a lunchly that moves. Yeah, I think the visuals are so much worse than Scratch. I can't even lie. It's weird that you're forced to make pixel art. I feel like it kind of limits the potential of these games when it would be pretty easy to allow you to like a bigger screen, I feel like. I want the Lunchables to follow the Prime bottle and I want to at least to be able to shoot bullets at it. Maybe let's do a projectile and then we can code it later. Let me see what I could use for the projectile. Could I use pizzas? At Prime Bottle shooting pizzas? You know what, let's do it. Okay, let me do a brown circle. And a pizza has red stuff on it. This does not look like a pizza. Okay, let me let me put the cheese. This is like kind of yellow. That is not a pizza. Okay, let me set new variable bullets. The style of projectile. So we're gonna be shooting bullets for pizzas. Oh, here was a background. These backgrounds are actually really nice. That doesn't look too half bad. Wait, this actually might come out to be a pretty good game. So now that our lunchly can move, it's time to make some ingredients to collect. So let's start with the main ingredients, the pizza. So let's let's make a little pepperoni. This should be pretty easy actually. Okay. There we go. And now let's add some cheese. There we go. I mean, I feel like that's fire, that's fire. So now we, we have our pepperoni. Now when we start the game, you can see up here, there's a little lunchly pizza pepperoni peeking into the screen. Now we just need to make it fall. So now when you, when you start the game, you have a pepperoni, but you need to be able to collect it. So let's say, wait, you can make sprites talk? Wait, this is cool. Wait, I, I, I wanna see if it works. Oh, it's, that's actually so cute. Can I use this? Oh, that's so cool. This is cool. And I, I don't think you can do this in Scratch very easily, but like you're kind of grouping sprites together. So I, I don't have to reference them by their specific names. That means it'll be really easy to add all the other ingredients, which hopefully means we can finish this game in 30 minutes. Here it goes. Okay, okay. If mouse down, oh, it shoots it. Yes. Okay, now we just need it to shoot towards the mouse. It does work, but it spawns the pizzas every time I'm pressing this. Okay, change of plans. This is becoming like a plants versus zombie game now. We're just gonna be able to shoot pizzas like that at the at the Lunchables. Is there a weight block? Oops. Oh, yes! Okay, now there should be a delay in between the shooting. Yes! I think this is working. So we can shoot pizzas, I just need the enemies to spawn. What's this? What? No way, look at that effect. How did I not know about any of this? 36 minutes left. Okay, wait, we need to clutch up. Okay, this is actually kind of nice. I can't lie. I feel like we're figuring this out pretty easily. Now, when you collect the lunch leaves... Oh, it fell off the screen. All I need now is I need it to be at random positions. Hopefully, there should be a random block. <gasps> yes, I found it. Yes, it works. Now, I need the Lunchables to delete when it touches the pizza. 
Wait, this is a game changer. There we go. Okay, he dragged this inside of here. It's not working. Wait, it is working. It is just a delay. Yes, that guy came in clutch. I, ho I hope that wasn't cheating. So we have our lunchly pepperonis. Now what we need is the feasibles and the prime. Okay, I feel like this is not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not, it's not that, bad. that looks like a feasible bar to me. I think we're cooking. And now we just need the mold. I feel like you can tell this is mold. I feel like it, it does its job. And now if we make the rest of our projectile thingies, uh, prime, we have the feasible and we also need the mold. This, this should work, but it probably won't. I think we got a really good game coming along here. I think we need some music. Let me make the projectile a little bit faster. Okay, this might actually be a really good game. And let me make the time between spawns random also. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We might be cooking. Okay. That sound is kind of annoying though. So, let's me do the background music. Okay, we're gonna make our own musical track. Keep it works. Yes! Okay, that works. Please work. We cannot run this project. Oh, I messed this up, didn't I? So now, if I eat it, if I eat my lunch, Lee. Oh, 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 oh. Look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. This is huge, chat. This is huge. Wait, I can send a message? Wait. Let me set, like, let me make, like, a, let me make, like, an intro then. In uh, the medieval ages, Lunchly ruled the kingdom. Destroy all 50 Lunchables to win. <sighs> okay. We have a storyline. Now, all of these can't just be in the middle of the screen. I need to, like, hide them. I also have to make it so that the mold kills you and that... Missing this stuff kills you. But hey, that's that's good enough for me. That's good enough for me. We have a minute and 46 seconds. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. No, we have another minute. We have another minute. What can I add? What can I add? As the king of Lunchly, you must defeat all the Lunchables. So let's say there there's no way to win, but when you lose, it's like, your cheese was moldy. I like my cheese drippy, bro. Uh, so let's say game over. It almost works. Is there mold now? Mold. Oh, I missed. Yes. Yes. The mold kills you. 17, 16. Um, what else? What else? What else? Okay, let me let me do a final test. In the medieval ages, when she ruled the kingdom, until one day another tree came to the post. Okay, we're done. Yes, I think I did it. I'm scared. I'm so scared now. Uh, guys, look. I I know the timer may have run out, but like, look, 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 look. Maybe my timer is moving too quickly. You can make music from the train to the ring to the pen to the king to the ring to the pen to the king oh, look at all of this code what Woo! okay i feel like we have a game uh there's no like high score or anything that's time <laughs> the timer just went off wow the timer just went off Yo, <laughs> I just I finished like five minutes ago. I was testing it out to make sure any bugs. Oh, okay, sweet. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Like... No, me too. I finished. I haven't touched my code at all in the past five minutes. Should we play yours first? No, I want. Uh, no, you go first. Okay, you go okay. first. If you insist. Oh, let's save the best for last. Okay, okay. <laughs> it's time okay. to play Lunchly Game by Polly Mars. Wait, hold on. Let me listen. Let me. You you put the mold in the Lunchly, bro. You can't do that. <laughs> Oh, are you kidding me? I can't tell. That's mold. I, I think that's mold. That, yeah, the that's green mold. stuff is mold. Dodge right? the mold, and you have to collect the lunch lead. Oh. So yeah, you're building the lunch lead. There you go. There you go. I'm surprised you were able to fit the text on on the sprite. Oh, I was yeah. not able to. It, it looks just look. It looks just like the lunch lead. <laughs> I did mine's kind of different. Mine actually looks like a pizza, and it doesn't look like whatever you th whatever thing you drew. Well, I like this. It, it, the artwork is very detailed. Let's go. I'll, I'll, I'll be brutally honest and give it like a five out of uh, no. I'll give it like a six out of ten, maybe. Six out of ten. But the chat, but the chat will come to vote. Yeah, it. yeah. <laughs> cheese is moldy, bro. I like my cheese drippy, bro. It's time to see if your game is better. Oh, Lunchly versus Lunchables. Okay, you have a name for it for your game. That's already scaring me a little bit. Whoa, <laughs> what is this? Okay. In the medieval ages, Lunchly ruled the kingdom. Until one day, another treat came to invade the kingdom. Its name was Lunchable, and they tried to gain control. As the king of Lunchly, you must defeat 
all the Lunchables. Destroy all 50 Lunchables to win. How did you do I didn't even know you could do like dialogue. Okay. I'm a little, Me neither. I I'm a little that scared. Last minute. Whoa. Okay, Wait, so how did you make the music? The <laughs> Wait, the music's actually good. It was supposed to be a prime bottle. I didn't have I to. See. I didn't know how okay. to draw it. Okay, I'm, I'm prime. I, I can kind of see it. Just I see. <laughs> okay, so I'm prime. I'm destroying the launch balls. I see, I see. I have to destroy all 50. Oh, I got this. I got this. Yes. It, it should be pretty hard for a noob like me. What? Actually, <laughs> I'm a bit of a no pro way. at Lunchly versus Lunchables. No it took me like two deaths to get the well, win. Yeah, I guess I'm kind of a pro so at, at lunch league games. That that was pretty good actually. I feel like it had some good lore, and I I think the music is actually kind of fire. I I tried to make thick of it by KSI, but it sounded a little bit less. Green to the ring, to the pen, to the... Now, it is time for chat to decide who made the best Microsoft Make Code arcade game. I'm nervous. That's a really I'm long so name. I'm so nervous. All right. I'm gonna make a poll. Best yeah. Microsoft Make Code arcade game. Uh, we have Lunchly <laughs> game and Lunchly versus Lunchables. My games art was so beautiful. But it's not the art that matters, it's the gameplay. No, my, my game was so fun. Like dodging all the ingredients, dodging the mold. Yes! No, yes. no, no, seven. No. seven. All right, all right, we're coming back. Five, seven, five, seven. They're not thinking straight. They're not thinking straight. Five, seven. It's actually, it's really close. I'm scared. Yes, one more vote. Yes, uh, eight votes for me. Why is this so suspenseful? Like, I'm actually shaking. My hands are shaking. Okay, six to eight. Someone please vote. I know you guys were joking and giving your pity votes to Lunchly versus Lunchables, but let's be so honest. Pity votes. My, my game is just another, it's just on another level. They appreciate true gameplay. Which game was more beautiful? Life is about beauty. No, it, beauty is what matters inside. If I lose, I'm gonna quit Microsoft Make Code no. I'm never gonna use it again. No, first scratch and now <laughs> Microsoft Make Code Arcade. If I win, I'm gonna buy Lunchly and I'm gonna devour Wait, Lunchly. It's almost over. No, no, please. I'm gonna do please, it. please, please, please. <laughs> yes. Yes. Ooh. I hope your Lunchly has lots and lots of black mold.